And this great news comes on the same day east. COVID-19 restrictions go into effect in North Carolina. Just moments ago at 5 o'clock, restaurants, breweries, retail stores, and gyms were allowed to expand to 50% capacity. WFMI News 2's I'm Denise McMiller spoke with a few of those businesses who say they are ready. We're really excited to even... Uh at the chapter of the pandemic. Wes Wheeler owns Undercurrent Restaurant in downtown Greensboro. Friday is the first time in almost a year. The restaurant will close at its normal business hours. We are looking at a little bit busier of an evening and tomorrow even looks better. So, you know, it's, all, it's always good to have good news right now. Wheeler says reservations and limited walk-ins will keep them within the 50% capacity rule still in place for restaurants. The lifted stay-at-home order is something movie theaters hope will draw people out. Jennifer Talley owns the historic Graham Cinema. This is a beautiful old historic theater, um, circa 1928, and um, it has survived this many years uh, as a result of our loyal customer base and we're hoping to come out to a safe Tally says they're not planning any showings later than 7 p.m. until moviegoers show more interest. Venues and event spaces can also reopen at 30% capacity, but not all are reopening. Even with the new um, ordinances that have come out that have been lifted a little bit, our, the way our bathroom situation is situated, it's hard to keep people six feet apart. Heather Dotson is the president of the Greensboro Regional Realtors Association. They typically rent their space out for community meetings and weddings, but they'll stay closed. Well, the event center is a big part of our revenue with the rentals and um, events that we do typically host there. But and so it's been a little bit of an impact. And I spoke with Downtown Greensboro Incorporated. They say some bars need more time to prepare and will reopen next week.